let's see if we can design a recurrent neural network. I'll start by creating what I'll call a recurrent neural network cell. Each cell has an input X and an output Y. In addition, each cell has a hidden state. The hidden state is meant to encode some representation of the text so far. The idea is, each cell takes in the hidden state H from the previous cell, updates it with the input X, and passes it on to the next cell. We then examine the output Y of the last hidden cell. In the context of language modeling, I create a cell per unit I'm using. RNNs are great because there's no fixed length for each input. Let's look at one cell. I'll call the previous hidden state HT-1, the input XT, and the output YT. We can compute HT as some transformation to HT-1, plus some transformation to XT, plus some bias term, which is all passed through some nonlinear activation function. The idea here is I'm just combining all the features from the current input and the previous hidden state to get the next hidden state. An important thing to see is that to compute HT, I require HT-1, which requires HT-2, and so on. This is where the recurrent part comes from. 